Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is Professor Bauer. Welcome to week five, ICT 4670 Disaster Recovery and Business Continuity Planning. Good to have you here. Can you believe it? We're about halfway through our course. Wow, things run fast. Um, what we're going to be doing for our agenda in today's um, a roadmap video is uh, to look at uh, what we're going to be doing for our special class this coming Wednesday and um, 7 p.m. Mountain Time and we'll get you the coordinates from uh, the Veeam people. They have a special presentation. We get a chance to ask some questions. We'll talk a little bit more about that. More details as soon as I get the coordinates. So going to be a special time there. Um, coat and tie optional. Uh, but I know this is a remote session, but pants or clothing are definitely mandatory, all right? Don't want any surprises there. Um, instead of the regular discussion questions that we write up after class, I'd like you to write up your assessment of the, uh, the Veeam um, session that we have together. I'm thinking about doing some more with some other leaders in the industry, particularly in terms of data security in dealing with uh, some of the cybersecurity incidents and really the overall disaster recovery planning. So tell me what you think about it. Is it helpful? Does it help you learn? Is it worth your time? Those are the things that I really want to know. And then um, you've got a lot of reading on risk mitigation, so make sure you take care of that uh, as, a, as your homework this, uh, this coming week. Okay, for the Veeam session, um, we'll get... Um, We'll get you the details, as I just said a few minutes ago. Several folks from Veeam um, in product management, some developers and product managers, um, one of the managers of the product lab, um, a friend of mine, a, a former colleague at CompTIA is uh, going to be there as well. Uh, she's working in product marketing and strategic partnerships. I asked them to share with us a bit about cloud backup. You can track the trajectory of Veeam's success in the early 2000s with the uh, adoption of cloud. It's almost a one-for-one -one correspondence. They have done phenomenally well. And it's because they, I think, understand what the parameters are to make cloud backup work to the trust level of the folks who used to run all the data from their own uh, NOx, their own data center. So, we're going to ask them about that. We're going to try to explore what the what the role is of backup technology, whether it's to disk, to tape, whatever the format is. But what is that role? This is a very almost ancient technology. It's got to be 40, 40 years old. And yet, uh, and, and it seems like every spring someone says, tape is dead. Um, backup is dead, you know, it's, you know, we're doing it this way and this way and this way, but um, what is the role? And uh, we'll ask the Veeam people uh, about that. So after a couple of, of uh, questions that I'll ask, I want to open it up for you guys. So um, we'll have a chance to introduce uh, each other. And so you guys have a chance to introduce yourselves and then Fire away. Now, um, be respectful of their unpaid time. This is a, a, a freebie to us, and they're appearing um, later at night on their time, so we're very thankful. As I mentioned, uh, the marketing uh, partnership manager is Rachel Tuller. She is a very good friend of mine. She is a wonderful person and a wonderful woman who has made her way very successfully in her career um, in a, let's just put it this way, in an industry where women are not always thought of first. And so um, I would encourage you, if you have questions about that, uh, to think about that. You know, how have you made it, Rachel? How, how did you find success? Or how have your male colleagues, you know, since we're mainly guys in this class with one notable exception, uh, how, how have your male colleagues been able to support you in career, uh, help you in collaboration, and yet not be overly familiar or inappropriate? Uh, it seems that there's a boundary there. And how can you as an IT executive 
um, rising through the ranks. How do you relate in this way? Um, we only have a few minutes, but I'm sure Rachel will have some good uh, some good uh, responses there because she's she's clearly done it, and I have uh, I can name a few on about five fingers who have done well and who I know and um, that doesn't mean there's only five but who have done really well in this industry and have not compromised their principles their values and uh, have remained just really good people and Rachel's uh, that kind of person so anyway Veeam uh, look at their website before we get started but this is right from uh, their website, uh, their story, they were founded in 2006. They have quickly become a leader in backup. And I can tell you from my own experience, there were a lot of other um, competitors in that field. And um, I think the, um, the secret, or if there is a secret, is this relationship to cloud. And uh, 375,000 customers, that's amazing in a world where there's the next big thing and everybody runs to it, and then there's the next big thing and everyone runs to it, um, this company has some staying power. And so we'll, uh, we'll try to find out a little, bit, um, a little bit more about it. I'm impressed with their growth, with their partnership. Look at all the partnerships that they work with from the hardware side, from the software side, if you're a cloud provider, if you're a database provider, all these different companies, they have a solution for it. So um, pretty impressive and I'm looking forward to learning a little bit more about, uh, about the company. Um, so week five, topics. Um, you're gonna look at risk mitigation and how to start addressing all the problems that we've seen. We've looked at the project management constraints of doing risk management and business continuity planning. We looked at the structure, we looked at the planning. Now we're gonna actually start doing it. So the steps involved, um, everyone has risk. You can't make risk go away, but famously you have to mitigate that risk. Um, Veeam backup is a very, uh, would be a very appropriate way of not eliminating risk, but also being able to mitigate it to some extent. And the more you mitigate, the better your resilience is uh, in the face of this kind of an emergency. So week five, strategy development. There are no major assignments for this week, so do the readings. There's uh, a bunch of them, but um, make sure that Wednesday night, you're, you, you're bringing your A game. We will not have the discussion questions that we normally have to write up. Just write up uh, your assessment of the, uh, of the engagement with the Veeam team, uh, with the Veeam uh, personnel, and talking about the way that they're helping their clients solve these kinds of challenges. That's it. Have a great week five. Talk to you later. Bye-bye now.